The representative of His Highness the Amir Sheikh Sabah Al Ahmed Al Jabr Al Sabah, Minister of Foreign Affairs, Sheikh Dr. Ahmed Nasser Mohammed Al Sabah, chaired the Kuwaiti delegation partaking in the works of Corona Global Rep Response to the International Pledging Conference for COVID 19 vaccine held via virtual technology. The representative of His Highness the Amir announced that the state of Kuwait pledged an amount of $40 million contribution to the global efforts to fund research on the vaccine and other tools to combat the coronavirus. During the conference that was hosted by the European Commission President Ursula von der Leyen, the foreign minister noted that the state of Kuwait's total donation to support global effort in the battle amounts to a total of $100 million. Meanwhile, expressing gratitude to the EU and all our host and co-host organizing such as an important event. The foreign minister reiterated Kuwait's readiness to closely cooperate in the fight against the virus, stressing that it is an honor to represent His Highness the Amir Sheikh Sabah Al-Ahmed Al-Jabr Al-Sabah, who wishes all the best in all endeavors, especially in the combating the coronavirus. The representative of His Highness, the Emir, said that Kuwait, since the outbreak of the coronavirus, has donated 60 U.S. $60 million support to the efforts of the WHO to respond to the coronavirus threat in vulnerable countries, knowing that WHO plays a decisive role in containing the spread of the virus. Foreign Affairs Sheikh Ahmed Nasser Al Muhammad Al Sabah is joining us. Excellency, you have the floor. <clears throat> Thank you so much, Your Excellency, Mrs. Ursula von der Leyen, President of the European Commission. Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, it is my honor to represent His Highness Sheikh Sabah Al Ahmed Al Jabr Al Sabah, the Emir of the State of Kuwait, who wishes you the best in all endeavors, especially in combating coronavirus. I would like to express my country's appreciation to His Excellency, to Her Excellency, the President of the European Commission, for her great efforts in putting together this, this global conference to accelerate the development, production, and equitable access to the new COVID-19 diagnostic therapeutics and vaccines. Looking at all the high-ranking participants in this event has made two things clear. The EU maintains an important role and a high level of status and global respect. Secondly, the importance of collective efforts in combating the coronavirus pandemic. The state of Kuwait reaffirms its long-term commitment to the principles of international cooperation and the international order based on the rules and regulations stipulated in the Charter of the United Nations, especially in these times of crisis. I must, I must urge you all, despite the battle raging against coronavirus, we must not forget our effort to support the people of the world. There are still the issues of refugees, migrant poverty, famine, and the spread of other diseases. This is confirmation that the international community must stick together and greatly expand multilateral cooperation in order to survive these global challenges. Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, WHO plays a decisive role in containing the spread of the virus, and the state of Kuwait will continue to provide all kinds of support to this very important organization. The WHO has provided advice, assistance, guidance, recommendations, and support to countries with weak health systems and how best to respond to the virus. They have offered strategic support and resources in order to help unprepared countries develop their own national health plans. Since the outbreak of the coronavirus, the state of Kuwait has donated 60 million US dollars to support the efforts of WHO to respond to the coronavirus threat to uh, threat in vulnerable countries. To this end, I would like to announce Kuwait pledge in, di in this event endeavor to support this conf conference as well as future international efforts combating co co uh, COVID-19 pandemic of 40 million US dollars. Thus, Kuwait's total donation to support global efforts in this battle amounts to a total of 100 million US dollars. Again, I thank the EU and all our co-hosts for organizing such an important event. Once again, I would like to reiterate Kuwait's readiness to closely cooperate in the fight against this virus. Thank you all.